Today, we're talking about how to remove verified accounts and how to follow up with the credit bureaus, okay? So by the end of this video, you're going to know exactly what to do and what to say in your dispute letters to get results. But I have two very important things to remember. Number one, you can't say the same thing again. If you already said it's unknown, you can't ever say that again. And if you already said it's unverified, you can't say it again because it'll be frivolous. And asking for a method of verification as a dispute reason is literally a waste of 30 to 45 days, okay? If you're sending out dispute letter templates that use the dispute reason unverified. Keep in mind that each letter in this series literally says the same thing. Number one, this is unverified. Two, I told you it's unverified. Three, be advised that this is my third attempt to remove this account, okay? And one thing you may not know is that your letter is scanned, read, and matched against millions of other letters for a partial or full match of text. And if there is, it's an automatic verification without an investigation. So the first thing that you want to stop doing is sending templates, no more templates, okay? So here are the steps to disputing and removing verified accounts, but a bit of a warning, if you don't know how an account should and should not report, you may make mistakes here. So for charge-offs, we'll dispute the next blatant inaccuracy or next step in the hierarchy. Third-party collections will dispute the independent investigation or factually, such as payment history, and for the removal of a late payment, we'll either dispute the date as paid and put the burden of proof on the bureaus, or dispute the next date as paid and ask for an update of all late payment history. Now, what you should dispute, what you do want to dispute is date last active, date last paid, missing or missed time notice of dispute, first date of delinquency, last, uh, excuse me, late payment after account was closed, inaccurate late payment history. And what you do not want to dispute, do not open date, terms, type, status, payment status, and balance and past due if they are not actually inaccurate. Okay, keep these things in mind because you need to know what works and what doesn't. So if the account is verified, look at the account and ask yourself a simple question. If I had one chance to get this account removed and can choose one reason based on the actual account on the credit report in front of me, what would it be? We call this the apocalypse reason. Okay, so you're going to choose one of the following on the left and we're going to insert it into the dispute reason formula on the right. Delete or update this account because choice from the left column, such as date last active, is inaccurate. And then you want to put what it shows. So Experian, the date, the amount, et cetera. Equifax, date, amount, et cetera. TransUnion, date, amount, et cetera. So it would be like, delete this account because the, inac the, excuse me, the date last active is inaccurate, okay? And your dispute flow is literally one thing to the next. So as an example, if you use date last active, you are now going to go date last paid. Your next reason could be possibly failure to enter the notice of dispute or missed time notice of dispute. So this shows you exactly what you should be disputing in what order, okay? You should be able to choose the best action for what you're disputing now and be able to do the following steps. Number one, find the apocalypse reason. Two, know your exact next step to follow up with the bureaus in the event the account is not removed on this round. And three, have your battle plan mapped out using the current information and make changes as the actual account changes, okay? That is what this video is all about, but you can head over to my channel to find exactly what you're looking for using keywords, or you can schedule a discovery call with me at my740.com. I would recommend watching these two videos next, Credit Sweep Tactics and Formulas, as well as the Tactics Part 2 Kickoff, and they are both linked down in the description. But for right now, head over to my740.com to schedule that call. Hit me up on Facebook at Expert Credit Sweeps, or you can check out some awesome paid and free tutorials and even the deep dive work uh, the workshop at vault.my740.com or you can head over to hub.my740.com for the subscriber hub all right so that is it for today i hope you have a wonderful day and make sure to smack